friends. Welcome to Let's Make a Thing, where one man's trash is another man's treasure. Let's see what's in the box. It's a whole lot of spoons. There's already a giant island of plastic floating out there. You don't have to add anything to it. Let's save the planet and upcycle all these plastic spoons. You know, the drawer full you have from all those nights ordering takeout into a wonderful chandelier. So here's what you're gonna need. Got a hot glue gun, got a plastic bottle, a basket, a pair of snippers, and a little utility knife, and a uh, key ingredient. Plastic spoons. Let's make a thing. Step one. We're gonna cut a hole in the base of what will become a chandelier. I'm gonna go right about so. I mean, if your bottle has these ridges, it's great for guidelines and for pleasure. We're gonna start slicing around. Get to the quarter of the way. Yeah, there we go. Bottom is cut. We need to now prep our spoons. We're gonna use our snippers and clip right at the base. Let's get to the gluing. Okay, get a little glue onto this bad boy here. And we're going to press. The spoon chandelier is the patient man's game. So now we're gonna repeat this process 500 mind-numbing times. I think there's an artistic argument to say that this is done. She would say, I always finish too soon. Fine, Deborah, you win! Let's keep gluing. This took me 16 hours. And on the 16th hour, Kevin said, let there be light. But I need a light source for that. Lighting source. Make sure to use a low wattage bulb so nothing melts. Oh. That's gonna be something. Chandelier. Mm, sounds like a million dollar word, doesn't it? But now you can make one out of plastic spoons for like a dollar fifty. Ha ha! Congrats to you. You just made a thing.